it's quiz time again on the 8060 rule. Uh, hello, how are you? I hope you're good. Uh, my name's Mark. I'm 60, and this is hello, everyone. I'm Greg, and I'm 80. All right, 8060 rule today. Uh, we're going to get to the quiz in a little while uh, because we've got some other stuff to talk about. But uh, uh, Greg, aside from that, yeah, we should just take a second. And go, how you doing? How you feeling? You okay? All right. All right. All right. Good. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. That's enough. All right. Uh, yeah. Happy today. Some excellent football today. Uh, that's, I mean, that's in Minnesota. Uh, um, let's, uh, this is the New York Times quiz gang, which comes out every week. And I just like to, uh, I just like asking Mark what he thinks, what we learn. Okay. okay. Um, and then you're honest. You're honest. You tell us how you did too, right? You're yeah, honest. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. I mean the transparency. Yeah. Right. That's, that's the key word, right? Everybody said everybody's transparency. transparent. That's right. Congress this week voted to avert a strike in, in which industry? Air traffic control, dairy farmers, police officers, railroads, taxis. Uh that was uh, uh railroads. Right. Democrats elected the new new house leadership this week after Nancy Pelosi announced she would step down. Whom did they choose for the top job? AOC of New York, Hakeem Jeffries of New York, Catherine Clark of Massachusetts, Katie Poor of California, Peter Aguilar of California. Uh, Hakeem Jeffries of yes. New York. Let me make a point. I watched you shows today. Let me make right. a point. Good. I like Jeffries, but it's interesting. The Democrats got a leader from California, another leader from California, and a leader from Boston. How about the middle of the country? Oh, you know, if you're going to do all that, you better look at other people in the middle of the country. Yeah, if you're doing the coastal stuff. Um, uh, I just make a point of that, you know. Yeah, all I mean, right. I think he's the right guy for the job. He just happens. No, to Jeffrey's no, no, but Kathleen Clark is from Massachusetts. She's the whip. Yeah. Oh, she's the whip. Yeah. Yeah, okay. and the other guy, Aguilar. I thought you said Massachusetts. She's a witch. No, the I whip. Thought, a whip. That means yeah. she gets her caucus. In majority order. whip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. She took over for Stanley Hoyer. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Just pull right. that out. What's happening in this photo? Um, it's a picture of blank sheets of paper. Commuters wear it. Oh, I'm, yeah, I just gave you the answer. <laughs> uh, wait, let me see here. Is that something to do with a black sheet of paper? Yeah. Hong okay. Kong could have held up blank sheets of paper in a solar act of dissent in Hong Kong. Oh, in Hong Kong. Oh, all right. I'm sorry I gave you the answer. No, that's all right. I I, I wouldn't have gotten it, but uh, I feel uh, blessed that you uh, helped me out with that one. New York City's Mayor Eric Adams announced a plan this week to remove people with severe mental illness from the streets and do what with them? Sign each person a city-funded psychiatrist. Well, guys, ooh, man. Everybody, the psychiatrists would be, people should take that, go to school then. <laughs> a lot of money then. Bar them from fighting, returning to the city, house them in a new car, new care facility in Queens. House them in, house them in a new car? In a new care facility in Queens. Oh, right. Involuntary commit them to hospitals, send them to the Rikers Island jail complex. Uh, it was the second to last one, right? Yeah, Bob, we discussed yeah. that uh, earlier. Yeah, yeah, right. The Biden administration announced on Wednesday they would give three native tribes a total of seventy-five million dollars to do what? I got this wrong. Um, care for bison transferred from Yellowstone National Park. B. Host free harvest festivals in twenty twenty-three. C. Install wood farms on tribal land. D. Plant a billion trees by twenty twenty-five. And E. Relocate to higher ground to avoid rising waters. Oh, yeah, it's it, it's either that one because I've heard of uh, of uh, um, government government doing that. Um, so it's either that one or the wind farms. Man, uh, I, I'm gonna go uh, the wind farms. Okay, uh, no, uh, relocate to higher ground. Ah, uh, yeah, right. yeah. I tried to talk it through. Yeah. Uh, I'm sure it was fascinating, but I couldn't get it. 
Uh, President Biden this week, who do you host the first first state dinner? Mexico, the president, France president, French president, Zealand president, Canadian president, or Chinese president? Uh, Macron. All right. All right. Which volcano the largest? I get that right. I got this one wrong. Which volcano, the largest active volcano on Earth, erupted on Sunday? The one from Iceland, the one from Indonesia, the one from Hawaii, the one from Italy, the one from Japan. Hawaii. Yeah, I got that wrong. All right. I what got you this say? one wrong too. I, I don't know what it. I didn't say. I didn't say that. All right. Um, I got this one wrong. Um, the woman was cleaning the five, cleaning the five century old David. One of the world's most famous statues. Which Italian artist the sculptor did? Wait, say, can you say it again? A Is woman it... above is cleaning a five century old David. Oh, it's a picture. Most, yeah, the picture. Okay. What, what Italian artist sculpted it? Magdaliani, Augusta Rodin, Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, Wolfgang, Mozart. Uh, uh, it was uh, Da Vinci. No, Michelangelo. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I got that one. What and the last name? one? Oh, Christine was... McVeigh, a singer songwriter and keyboard artist, died on Wednesday at 79. She was the hit maker of a which popular band? Eagles, Cleveland Mac, Hart, Jefferson Airplane, the B 52s. Cleveland Mac. Okay. Fantastic I that, artist. I got that wrong, too. All right. I like this side. Why don't we do this? Uh, did you know? All right, Mark. Did you know? Did you know that caught your eye? Did you know that Thailand removed marijuana flowers? You order the plant that makes one smokes high to get high from its narcotics list in June as part of a plan to promote small scale cannabis farming. Oh, all right. I did uh, not know that. Did you know that experts have coined the term triple demic? Triple demic. Did you know that? I've heard of it. I don't triple know what the triple thing. Well, the words of uh, three different things: COVID nineteen, the flu, and respiratory and RSV. Oh, RSV. all right. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Did you know that um, across America there are some fifty million acres of landlocked land, state and federal land that is surrounded by private land with no legal entry by road or trail. How many? Um. 50 million acres of landlocked land. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's Did you know owned by the nine government. out of 10, nine out of every 10 people in Qatar are from other countries? Nine out of 10? Yes. Wow. Oh, yeah. yeah. Isn't that interesting? Oh, Did you just, know? That's because they're counting them this week. They're all from the World Cup. So yeah. Maybe that's yeah. not accurate. Did you know that? I never heard of this before. Rush. My race horse. 21 20, 21 12. 21 12. 39 years and 180 days old when he died this month, making him perhaps the longest living thoroughbred ever in the United States. Rush. Wow. Rush. No, I never heard of Rush. Never heard of him. Getty Lee? For me? Um, Did you know that um, in Qatar, like most other countries in the Persian Gulf, relies heavily on migrant workers? 90% of the country's population are farmers. Yeah, well, that kind of makes sense because so many are not, uh, nine out of 10, you said, weren't from there. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, did you know that under the Espionage Act, there's no president in the United States for prosecuting a publisher of information, unlike a spy or a government official who leaks secrets? There, there's no punishment for. A, a, Yes, there is. A publisher of information. Oh, a publisher of information. Yeah. So wait, well, it's like if I'm a spy and I give my stuff, my information to the New York Times and they publish it, they won't get punished. Yeah, right. that's right. The way I look at it. Yeah. Wow. Okay. But I will because I was the yeah. spy. Okay. Hmm. All right. Did you know that uh, after it's baked traditional English fruitcake, it's periodically basted or fed with high proof alcohol and completely wrapped for several weeks or even months. Fruitcake. 
Yeah, I, I did what? know that. Did, did you know that? that? Yeah, I did know it. Here, back up a little bit, Greg. All right. Um, I didn't know that in a fruitcake. Remember, people, we talk talk fruitcake. All right, never mind. All yeah, right. yeah. Next, they get uh, passed around from year to year, basically. Yeah. Did you know across the country, 600 million tons of waste is generated in the construction and demolition of buildings and infrastructure? According to a 2018 estimate from the Environmental Protection Agency, 600 million tons of waste. Isn't that something? Right. Yeah, from demolitions and things. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, did you know, uh, let me pronounce this word correctly, polysomnography is the gold standard of sleep tracking that involves looking, hooking up birth sensors, that hooking, involves hooking up sensors to someone's face and neck to measure eye movements and brain activity. So you don't have to repeat the name again. It's to measure... It's the science of measuring a sleep track that involves hooking up sensors to someone's face and neck to measure eye movements and brain activity. Oh, okay, cool. All right. Did I didn't you know that. that this year's annual annual holiday light show and window displays at Sucks Fifth Avenue in New York City took more than 250 people, around 40,000 hours to complete. 40,000 hours. Ah, that's that's too many. They got they got people. They got to cut yeah. it down to like 20,000 yeah. hours. That's a lot of waste. Long and the breaks. last one, the last one I'd like to share with you. Okay. Um, it took, it takes five to 15 years of growth before Christmas trees are tall enough to be harvested. Oh, really? Yeah, that's, yeah. that's a good fact. Five to 15 years. The National Christmas Tree Association. Wow. Wow. Talk about waste. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> You know, I love these. Did you know? I yeah, can't kind of remember stuff. a lot of them, but but it's interesting. Yeah, how facts come. You were going rapid fire. I was like a question behind you because I was like, oh wait, I think I know that, and then you're on to the next one. Well, um, I uh, we have we have our time limits here. We have our time limits, and also, uh, if I didn't know it by the time you finished it, I wasn't going to come up yeah, with it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll well, learn. I just want to say thank you if I enjoyed it. Uh, go with their team. Uh, sorry about the Bears. I'm sorry about the Bears. I like the Bears too. And uh, we'll be better next year. Oh, the Bears will? The Bears will. Yeah, yeah with uh, uh, Justin Fields. Yeah. That's the QB. All right, Greg. Really nice to talk to you. All right. Likewise, Mark. Thank talk you. Again and thank, thank you, everyone. Everybody. Have a nice week, everyone. Have a nice week. Thank you, everyone. Bye. Bye.